Has the show started yet? Has the show started yet? No, you dummy. You see the screen still black. Bro, school over. You hogging up all the room. But well, when is it going to start? Girl, can you please shut up? How about all of y'all shut up and just press play? If y'all are old to my channel, then y'all already know how much I love Ali Pearl hair. Not simply because the hair is bomb, but because a lot of my first time experiences when it comes to this wiggy wig game all came from them. Roll the tape! They introduced me to my first 6x6 six six closure wig, okay? As well as the 180% density wig, which has changed my life forever. And today's video is no different. To add to our growing list of first times, Ali Pro has sent me another little something something I've never tried before or actually even heard of. Some of y'all may be familiar with old 360 wig units where you have lace all around the perimeter of your wig so you can pull your hair up into a ponytail to get like that nice little sexy top knot bun, okay, little ninja bun and you half up, half downs, okay? But I ain't here to talk about that. No, I'm, I'm really not. I'm here to talk about what I got sent. And your girl got sent, not a 360 wig, but a 370 wig. What's poppin'? Now this 370 unit does have all the qualities of a 360 unit, but instead of the four inches of parchment that you get with a 360, they done got you a big kahuna, girl. You done got a whole six inches. Can you handle that? <laughs> I honestly think it's a pretty dope concept. More parking space just makes any install look more realistic. This wig is pretty much if a full lace wig and a 13 by 6 lace front wig had a baby, this is what it'd be. This is Ali Pro Hair's 370 straight unit. This particular unit is only offered in 180% density. However, since this is a wig that has less weft and has more um, insurgence of hair, in English terms, more parting space equals more single stranded knots. And whenever there is less weft, less track, and more knots, um, you are definitely gonna get more of a lighter wig. Even though this wig is 180, it does definitely feel a little bit lighter than Ali Pro's typical 360 or regular 13 by 6, 13 by 4, or closure wigs. So just make sure you guys keep that in mind that you are compromising your parting space for your density. Hopefully later on down the road, Ali Pro will make their densities a little higher when it comes to this 370 unit. But until then, your girlfriend is still slay this one. Okay, it's what we're working with. Right here, you guys just see me molding down the lace with my glueless method. This is the glueless method that I featured on my channel a little while ago. I'll definitely link it down below. Um, this glueless method is used with Dollar Tree Mousse, which is so, so affordable. Y'all know I'm all about saving that coin. If you guys have not seen that video, I'll link it down below in the description box, okay? I also work with Ali Pearl with that video as well, honey, okay? Guilty plug, guilty plug. I'm gonna let y'all know off rip. I'm not very experienced <laughs> when it comes to the 360, let alone the 370 unit area. Um, I don't need to stick to my closure wigs, my 13 by four, 13 by six wigs. So I ain't gonna lie, I was kind of struggling when it came to this style. Since I was using a more fancier of a wig, I wanted to keep the mood going and try a style that actually showed off, you know, the features of the wig. So I did a half up, half down child. Well, at least attempted to do a half up, half down. And I'm mad with y'all. And I'm mad with y'all because y'all didn't tell me how hard this style was going to be for me. Listen, y'all YouTubers here on the tube, Y'all make this junk look so freaking easy, so I got some beef with every last one of y'all. Listen, when I tell you I was ready to throw in the towel and quit to, with a capital T, y'all gonna see I really had no idea what I was doing. Girl, I had my wig cap showing and all. It, I was so shamed. I was so shamed. It turned out cute, but I was still ashamed. I felt like I had my draw showing. The way my cap was peeking through my wig. Girl, it was a mess. It was a mess. Behind the scenes and on camera both, it was a hot mess. But I feel like I done talked long enough. Y'all gonna see the mayhem a little bit unfold on camera. I'm gonna just be quiet. Let y'all bop and vibe to the music and I'll talk to y'all in a few minutes.
this is how the hair turned out. Uh, really? <sighs> this half up, half down nonsense. I don't see how y'all do it. <laughs> Make it look so effortless. I just, I just don't. I'm sorry. I just don't see how y'all are doing this. This was so hard for me to do. I almost quit. But it did turn out cute. My waves, of course, turned out really, really cute. Y'all already know how I do. I'm gonna put all the information and the specs to this hair on this side or over here, whichever one I choose to do for the day. It's extremely soft. With this unit, you are able to put this up into a ponytail, put it in a high bun, and a half up, half down like I chose to do today. First thing I realized when I first applied this wig, even though this wig is advertised as 180, it definitely feels a lot thinner. Um, at first it kind of scared me because I thought maybe okay I was sent the wrong unit. But I did a little bit of my research and I saw some more videos of my own searching. Everyone that has reviewed this wig or reviewed a 370 wig on YouTube says that it's a lot thinner. Um, I'm guessing because you're getting less weft. You get a lot more hair on a track and on a weft than you will that if the hair is injected strand by strand which does make the hair a lot more fine, a lot more thin. That's why this hair feels a lot lighter. The hair is not thin but I definitely feel the difference because I'm so used to 180% density from Ali Pearl to where I felt the difference right away. So for that, you're pretty much compromising your density for your parting space because you have a six inch deep, but you're getting like a lot thinner of a wig. I'm not sure if you guys can order a 200% density wig. I'm sure if you guys were to order a 200% density wig, that would probably be your 180 with the 370 wig because of the fewer tracks. It's definitely not 150, but it's not a full super thick 180 either. But in all, like a 370 wig does make sense. You're getting lace all around the perimeter and you are getting a deeper parting space, which is ideal for most wig wearers. I never really pull my hair up into a ponytail. If you guys are one that like to have top knot buns, then this is definitely a wig for you while also giving you a deeper parting space. Now, as far as the hair's quality, Ali Pro's quality is always A1. I have not received any shedding, any tangling, but in all honesty, I do kind of feel as if the hair texture is a little bit different. I have tried Ali Pro Pro straight and Ali Pro body wave as well. This unit doesn't feel as silky as their other units, but it does feel silky. This unit has more of a medium luster, medium type of silk, natural type of silk. This hair feels more so to me like pressed out and silk pressed hair. If you guys have ever tried Ali Pro silky straight hair or their body wave and straightened it, then you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. This hair is still bouncy, it's still flowy, but I can definitely tell that there is a difference. But of course, they aren't the same units. They aren't the same kind it's just you know a 370 unit now let's jump into this hairline I made it my business to not pluck this hair at all I'm really really over plucking I feel like I've morphed into like a lazy type of wig wear I did not add any powder to purposely show you guys I could have very well just added some powder but I did want to show you guys how it looked without any powder the hairline definitely does look natural so in a nutshell I do love the hair everything Ali Pearl produces I love only hang up that I do have is if there's a possible way to make the wig a little bit thicker even though this hair does have less track. Maybe if more single strands are added into the lace or maybe even more tracks are added into the middle of the head, that could probably help the hair be more so of a true to 180 density. But like I always say, nevertheless, the hair is still bomb. If ever there is a hair review that I may give or a hair video that I may post, and I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend you guys look at more videos. One of you guys actually let me know that you guys saw another video of someone else and that the two different opinions helped you a lot when choosing one of the purchase or not from the hair company and I applaud that because there's nothing more valuable than your hard work coin. I was gonna give my 100% honest opinion no matter what, no matter who I'm doing a video with. But of course, you guys always, always, always look at other YouTubers' videos, look at more reviews. I will leave my top hair reviewers that I watch here on YouTube. We typically review the same companies, so I think it would be beneficial if you guys look at those videos and those channels to give you a better representation of the hair that you are seeing here on this camera. <laughs> Because I always want you guys to be in the know and to be aware of everything that you guys are purchasing. If you guys are purchasing, if not, I'm here for your entertainment, entertainment only. In the process, I am showing you guys hair, sharing with you guys my experiences with the hair that I received. I'm never trying to force hair down your throat. You guys can wear a drawstring ponytail for all I care, and I still be riding for you. So it's not really gonna matter whether you buy the hair or not. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please do not forget to give your girl a big thumbs up and of course, subscribe to the channel down below. Join the Beehive Gang, the Beehive Family, because we are lit and we are never ever bougie over here do you understand me i know you want to keep in contact with your girl because i'm your best friend you're my best friend we're all best friends so add your girl on instagram
I mean, what? And as always, I love every single one of you. But until next time, my lovelies, your crown may tilt, but you never let it fall. Stay gilded, 